cannot hate on no nigga Just gotta wait my turn Chasing the check, it ain't nothing but a word Lean to the side every time that I swear Hold on, baby, gotta twist my Rest in the day. What are they at the That's not nice enough. All that for the baby, man. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Sassy and Demon. Damn, the baby just cannot catch himself a break. Like, what is going on here? First of all, last week, he was getting harassed by the police up in there in Charlotte while he was trying to do a show, saying that he was insist, uh, resisting arrest, inciting riots, saying that he was, well, I'm probably wrong about the riot part. They was trying to say that he was uh had, like, minor amount of marijuana or whatever, but they won't let up. Now, according to this TMZ article, he was taken into police headquarters in Miami for questioning about a robbery that occurred around 12.30 p.m. earlier. About seven cars had pulled up on the baby when he had got cuffed. Now, they got footage as well of this incident y'all are going to see in a couple seconds right here. There's no audio of it, but some of us were able to capture it from their phone from like an upper level of what had happened. And I was like, now, when you look at the video, you're going to see that the baby, it, it don't look like him. But, that, with, with the, but of course, what the police are alleging is that the baby and his crew had allegedly jumped, beat up, and took a man's money as well as some personal property in broad daylight. Now, it, like in a couple of seconds, you're gonna see it. Shout out to uh, Amadi the Ruler on on Twitter for this footage right here. So you can see it right what's going on right here. A dude just getting getting whooped on and getting his stuff stolen from him right in broad daylight. As somebody from an upper level is recording the footage as well. Now, it's easy to say that, oh, that's him, but guess what? We don't know if that's the baby innocent until proven guilty, you know what I'm saying? And this is crazy because the, the baby's worth millions of dollars. Why in the hell would he be robbing people? Said just one day, unless he just decided just to be like, fuck it. That that don't make sense. This dude is worth millions, so I don't, I don't, nothing, logically, it doesn't make sense for him to be involved in any of this. I hope this is a mis uh, case of mistaken identity. And it's, they're saying the reason the police was going had arrested the baby and his people was because they were in the area when it happened. Now they have no proof. Now even though they got that little footage right there, you know, on TMZ, they cannot prove that the baby was in that footage. Or that was him. Might have been a case of mistaken identity, but this don't make no sense right here. Like it really, it really don't, cause this dude literally had hit after hit all 2019. What sense would it make for him to want to rob somebody? But of course, even with money, some people do tend to act stupid. But the baby didn't. The baby never came. Uh, came off to me as a rapper that just took to that type of activity. Last time we heard, of course, the only time we hear uh, BS is when people try the baby, try and step to him in public, try to uh, mess with him and his family while he was at Walmart. You saw where he shot a dude, killed the dude in self defense, and rough dude up and had dude in his britches over in his drawers over there at the at the at the at the Gucci store in North, at Charlotte. That's about it. We don't ever hear about the baby just wilding out and doing just crazy stuff back to back. People just be trying him. That's why I honestly think this whole situation is a case of mistaken identity. But knowing, knowing the hip-hop police, all they got to say, oh, you're in the area, so you're a suspect. But we don't fuck. We don't. But we don't know. Like I said, innocent until proven guilty. Now, now, when you think about it, theoretically, this is not a good way to start 2020, getting messed with by the police. That is not a good way for the year to start off with uh, for somebody like the baby because this man has an artist of his of course he got he got artists like stunner for vegas that's doing is going crazy right now what sense does it make for him to want to get into this type of trouble before he i mean he's already blown up he is pretty much the hot one of the hottest dudes in the game right now so what sense does it make for him to do something like that if he had any intentions of doing it? That's why I don't think he did it at all. But, of course, he will have his day in court like everybody else will. And as the story progresses, I will keep you guys updated. 
And it was just crazy how he's a he was he's getting messed with in Miami when just last week he was claimed he said that he was targeted by Charlotte police and they harass him every time he comes to his home state, whether it's for a performance or a visit. I believe it. Not only are people in the streets hypnotized with hatred, but the police are as well. But like I said, I'm gonna keep y'all guys updated as the story goes on of what could happen. I hope. I hope this I hope nothing else messed up happens. But yeah. Tell what y'all think about it in the comment section. Hit the like button, subscribe, share, and comment for more videos. Hit the bell button so you'll be notified every time I upload a new video. And as always, thank you for tuning in Sag Season TV. I'm out.